hey everyone welcome welcome to this channel and welcome to this video so basically what i want to show you what is hugging face as you can see on my screen hugging face is kind of a it is a platform it is an open source community and it focuses on means everyone on anyone can put their models in so it is the kind of a platform with the pre-trained models so we know that the large language models like llama open ai all the different different models and then those can be again trained on some data and those pre-trained models are available here so if we just have a look quickly and then i will take you straight to my solution uh, which is the test case generator so it is the hugging face it is kind of a git and kind of a github or git like a git lab kind of thing where people store their solution people store their pre-trained models here and you can fetch all those models and you can again reuse those for your particular solution purpose or some other purpose or for your coding purpose so what i have done uh, basically just to showcase that i have created a solution based in pycharm pycharm is the platform and pycharm is the ide which is the smart editor that i have used here and i have created a solution based on some of the other stuff and including some other stuff and this is called test case generator and how it is working and what it is working basically it is based on the mistral ai and um, I'm using Hugging Face API, I'm using Python and using some other solutions and tools here. I'm just um, working on this one. So just to showcase you quickly what it is basically, it is the test case generator. So for example, here is a user story. You give it the user story. For example, you say as a user, I want to reset my password so that I can regain access to my account if I forget password. And you, you provided the format as well, kind of. Means this is just a program and it runs in a simple click, but in the background what this particular solution does it has a test case uh, kind of a format that it will generate as a positive test case negative test case and as scenario test case and i have created it as a uh, prompt to the ai and which will do the job in the background but just to showcase you if i run it quickly this particular program it will showcase us in the console here now it is the program is running on the bottom of the screen you can see here that the program is running and it will bring back as the result and as i said this is really really game changer for all the functional testing guys you can generate your test cases in one click with this solution this solution is available on hugging face and you can use it so now it has generated these seven test cases if you see here in the console let me grab it a bit and then you can see so basically it is saying the positive test case user successfully resets password precondition it is giving user is logged out and has a registered account and the steps are navigate to the login page click on forget password and blah 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 and then expected results user is logged in with the new password the negative user tries to reset password with an unregistered email third one is the edge case scenario user tries to reset password with an invalid email format and then another edge case scenarios and go on and on and on so the thing that i want to showcase here that you can create your test cases with any user story you want you just need to give a user story to it and it will do all the job so what i am doing now i'm going to put that user story with a little bit different thing for example as everyone is aware about the gmail so i am just changing this user story with the gmail user story it is saying i want to test the gmail login page its login functionality along with the forward password page and then going to run this program and it will tell you like again it ran in the console and it gave us 10 scenarios now so if i just stretch it a bit and uh, just show you the positive scenario is verify gmail login with valid credentials it will tell you what is the precondition that the open the gmail login page the steps it is giving enter a valid email address enter valid password click sign in button and expected results similarly the negative scenario is verify gmail login with invalid so same like the previous user story but a bit different because we all are aware about gmail and all that functionality so it is giving all different different scenarios like this negative scenario this negative this negative this negative and then some edge case scenarios so total 10 scenarios it generated it all works in the back Ground on the Mistral AI model and we can further modify that how many results we want so I have set something here up that what is the maximum token value it should take what is the temperature and all that stuff but that goes on the AI background of this one I don't want to deep dive into that one but all in all it is a really uh, I would say it is really a good solution based on the Python and a simple programming it doesn't need really really that much kind of a complex programming but it is using Mistral AI in the background so that's all for today I am going to uh, give you the link for my hugging face solution repository as well which is having all this thing and that's about it and uh, i would say please explore and if you have any feedback then please let me know now back to the hugging face hugging face is having the similar kind of multi multi different models you can just go explore like this one is about uh, you can say this is about one model from 
Microsoft is from perplex perplexity. If you want to do anything specific like image to video kind of model you want to use or text to image, you can go here. So all the NLP models are available here on all the audio models are available here. So that kind of stuff is there. So please feel free to explore um, the stuff out from here. And it is really a beautiful world to explore. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.